Hi everyone, I decided again late, <laughs> again late when it's dark, so I don't have a daylight, to do a little video on the small bags because, you know, I, I, I thought it could be helpful for someone who is searching for not only like Neverfulls or Speedies or big bags, and these little bags are, you know, these little bags are really cute too. So, as I said, <laughs> I don't have a daylight anymore because I was postponing this again, like, so long, <laughs> you know, that, yeah. Okay, anyway, let's start. So, uh, as you probably know, uh, this is the Eva clutch. This is another Eva clutch in Damir Zur. This is Damir Bean. And these two are the Palace clutch. Every bag is from different place or different seller and different factory. And uh, they are not the same quality too. So it's like yeah, could be helpful for someone. So let's start. So let's start with this one. So this one is from Steven and it is in, as you see, it is in Damier Bean. I tried to do a close up on the canvas. Somebody needs the V and U not touching, which is right now, yeah, which on this bag is. They're not touching, but, oh, we got my hair <laughs> stuck here on the plate. So, but again, I have seen authentic bags uh, where the V and U is touching too. So it's not like the indicator uh, always like of the quality or grade or something like that. Okay, me too. Okay, welcome my guest. <laughs> she must be everywhere. I like uh, the plate on it, and it's like a little bit smudgy again because I just took it like out of the closet and took off the the plastic and I touched it with my hands, which was not a really good idea. But I like the plate on it. Uh, the plate looks like this, if I can focus on it. Like, oh my god, like this. And um, it should be, of course, right in the middle. And under, uh, there should be a peaking the, uh, the canvas print like is here and I think it maybe should be even a little bit more but I'm not really sure it's like peaking like up here the same thing uh, over or above the plate and below the plate what uh, I was told or I think this is like if you go one to five a quality this should be the 5A. And about the purple, some people wants to know uh, that it's like a little bit dirty. <laughs> Sorry, I will clean it up. Uh, some people, uh, you know, are like super picky and they will for sure find some flaws. But like, I think it's the better quality. Like, it's definitely the better one than others I have seen. The canvas is sturdy, it's not rubbery, which is plus, and the chain has a uh, like really good weight to it, so like it's, it's of course it's not plastic, it's metal, and it looks, I think it looks like the authentic, in my opinion. The, uh, the strap is shoulder strap or crossbody strap, it's really long, it's more of a crossbody, but only thing which I'm not sure about is the length of the zipper. Uh, the zipper has, you know, doesn't have to be really, really short. Like on the mini pochettes, for example. I'll show you the stamping. 
the heat stamp if it's possible this is the heat stamp it looks decent quality but I think the zipper should be a little bit more shorter let me know <laughs> if I'm wrong otherwise the hardware looks really nice and it is a beautiful little bag with yeah, see the zipper works really smooth even with one hand and the inside the interior is nice red color like uh, on the Damieri Bean they often do red interiors it looks nice with the print together I checked it in uh, the sunlight and it has a little bit of purple too like all almost all the wraps you know and authentic too but uh, the purple is minimum so now I show you <clears throat> the same bag but lower quality you know if you look like I'll show you around it it has all the logo placement correct placements like this one you can compare it has the same you know same place uh, the logos are at the same place on the sides everything is centered on the back side is the same I show you a close-up of the canvas looks like this and the VNU is not touching but you see like you know I don't care about the the VNU uh, touching because I care more about the overall quality which this one when you put these two aside uh, you see the difference one big difference is the canvas this is like really really flimsy this is flimsy see the difference between this you know when I move this and when I move this you know it's really thin the canvas on this but uh, it has a beautiful patina I use this bag like maybe if two three times and uh, because I have it a really long time it's like you know maybe eight years or something like that I don't know long time and it developed itself beautiful honey brown patina without putting anything including leather conditioner anything the leather tab on the side also you see it has patina it has the correct correct stamping everywhere and the zipper is actually you see that the zipper is much shorter than on the brown one which is like this so you see the difference in the length of the zippers so I'll show you the stamping and even the stamping and stitching you know stitching is nice and light yellow and stamping looks nice and clear but now I see that this stamping is actually upside down uh, you know if I look at these two you see this one is facing to me on the brown one from Steven and this one it was like um, not even from a seller it was from some website is facing this way the other way not uh, like to me which I'm this way <laughs> which I'm here yeah so I didn't know about that I found out I found about it right now and let's compare the tabs on the sides uh, the leather yeah they look pretty similar but the stamping on this one is on the on a button button or rivet or what whatever it is is LV but on this one the shape is different of the letter tab and there is Louis Vuitton stamped on the on the button rivet so that's another difference and <clears throat> what I don't really like again uh, the chain on this 
is uh, like it looks the same but it is much lighter than the brown one and although the brown one is uh, more gold gold and this is more light gold it looks silver but it's not it's like really light gold you know you see the difference uh, in the quality of the chain this one is like a more proper chain and this one is like thinner it's thinner and you can see even if if this one is maybe less wide it is much heavier and thicker than on this one and the plate again it's peaking here and peaking here but what I found when I was really like checking it and again you see the beautiful plate that the plate is a little bit like off you know like like this like a little bit off to one side not the leather under the plate but the plate itself if you look yeah but for like all those years i didn't even notice and i show you what's inside it has the crossbody strap too uh vachetta of course but i don't know where it is right now so i didn't uh, bring it up for a video i probably put it somewhere years ago it has this oh my god it has this beautiful <laughs> you see i almost didn't use it but this beautiful lining inside with, with uh, even a, like <laughs> rest of the stitching i guess it has a date code of course somewhere like yeah of course and as i say i can't say from which seller it is because it was a long time ago and i bought it from a website which uh, the person doesn't even like sell anymore or i don't even have the contact it's really long time ago so now let's go uh, to the pink one first so on palas bags even on the bags uh, because they make palas clutch which is this one they make palas bb and then bigger sizes palas and they all have this v with the leather that's all the palas bags uh so on the palace bags if it's in noir in black monogram and black it always the palace bags have a brown vachetta or brown leather strap always clutch is bb bigger i don't know why but if it's mono monogram and black it always have a dark strap so that's one difference which is actually correct yeah on, on these two i got some fur balls on them <laughs> yeah i have to watch my guest she she went away so uh the difference between the these two like i would i would rate these two a uh, same quality grade i would give it like four to five actually well maybe five because you know all of the bags will have some flaw if you really look and if you're really picky this canvas is much more sturdy than this but none of them is so flimsy like this and thin you, you see it is like you can even see it when i take it to my hand this one is a little bit less sturdy than this one but both of these are really good quality and beautiful canvas and everything yeah they're a little bit rubbery but not not too much it's okay so the chain on this one if we yeah we can compare i love comparisons <laughs> it's it's yeah it's really like useful to see so uh the color of the hardware is more or less yeah focus more or less the same as you see yeah it's not it's not much like um, rose gold it's like normal gold it's not very light but it's like normal all the hardware on both again has the proper stamping you see and now let's see stamping 
uh, the hard stem on the leather on this one. Focus, yeah. This is the hard stamp and font on this one. And this is the hard stamp and font on this one. You see, there is a difference. This one is smaller and uh, more, the letters are more, these, you know, it, this one is definitely bigger. Let's see. If I put it like that. Yeah. So you see the difference. Now, the color of the canvas. I have two lamps and a ceiling light. But still, I will try to show it as much as possible. This canvas is... This is the close-up. And it, sh it could be a little bit lighter. But it looks quite good. I can't complain on this one. This one is from Anna. Or Anna. Anna. <laughs> yeah. This one is from Sam. MMM bags. And the canvas looks like... The canvas looks like this. I'll try it in a same angle. Yeah. So, I can't compare even on this one. The colors are like... Mm, the colors are pretty similar. There is a difference though, and I will try to pick it up on the cam. There is a tiny difference in the color. But both of them are really, in my opinion, both of them are nice. Yeah. If I pull it like that, you see. Yeah. So, uh, the, the chains we compared, canvas and leather. And now, yeah, this one is better. Uh, with the zipper pull, which is like nice and thick, good quality. Whether as this one has the zipper pull, uh, kind of like enough big, like this, and the proper stamping, everything. But if you look from the side, it is much thinner than the other one. I can put them both in one picture. Yeah, I can try at least. And if I put them... Oh, come on. <laughs> okay, we have some fun. Yeah, if I put them like this, you see the difference. You see the difference. Oh my god. <laughs> this is really funny, you know. Like, yeah, you see the difference between them it's quite a big difference but both of the zippers works good smooth everything and nice so this is the lining uh, oh and the palace bags have this V and there is a like kind of a hidden pocket pocket where you can fit your phone or something because these bags are really small. Trust me, like, I love them, but, you know... And these are still better than the EVA clutches. Because in the EVA clutches, like, they are, like, low. They're not only, like, tiny, like, uh, this, wide, but they're low. And, you know, you can't even fit a wallet in there. <laughs> no. <clears throat> so, yeah. But they are cute, as I said. So, the pocket here, and there is a pocket here, of course. With, like, really good canvas lining. And uh, this is the interior, which actually has a big pocket here on the back side. And I will try to show you this, the inside 
This is the inside stamp on the black one. Yeah. And this is the interior of uh, the pink one. Again, well made, same as the black one. A big pocket here. And this is the inside stamping on the pink one, the monogram and pink one. So it looks, again, the font is bigger. I, I see it bigger, but you know, everything is nice and clean. No loose stitches, nothing like that. So I hope that <laughs> this helped to someone, you know, as you see, even if you buy like high, really high quality, it will always have some flaws. Everybody, you know, has different preferences. Somebody likes the canvas color and doesn't care about the font. Uh, somebody likes, uh, you know, Vachetta. Like the glazing here could be more dark. I forget to say. Uh, it's, it's thick and the stitching is nice and tight but a nice color it's not bright yellow it's quite light yellow you can i can show it here again i got it's dark so this is a lamp light and then lamp light is uh, is yellow so it's it's making different colors but the glazing could be a little bit darker but you know it's good quality fancy for pool and you know thick canvas this one is a more flimsy canvas but not too much but the color i like a little bit more and it has nicer stamping in my opinion and uh, the strap is actually softer much softer leather than this one the vachetta one and it's not it's not that thick there yeah it's even thinner a little bit, but not too much. And it's much more comfortable because it's soft, softer leather. Yeah. So everybody, you know, cares about different stuff. You know, somebody wants to have thick canvas. Somebody wants to have on the Neverfuls cares about Vachetta cuts, which are not even like, yeah. Yeah. Somebody cares about the leather. Somebody wants to have a uh, light gold hardware or short zipper, long zipper, whatever. So, you know, somebody cares about the interior. So it's always about research and uh, none of the bags will ever be perfect. Even the authentic bags are crooked. Trust me, they are. They are. No bag is like like completely perfect, you know, so do your research, always look at at least like two to four to six sellers pictures, always compare the pictures of the authentic and replica if you're gonna buy some and then and the prices of course and then you can choose. This is what I recommend. This is what I always do. And I always like ask questions. This is important thing too. Always ask questions before you buy. Because when you buy, there's like nothing you can do when you receive a package and you are disappointed. That is like, yeah, you can change the bag or uh, whatever. You can do something. But, you know, the whole process you know it's like it's frustrating and of course it's making you upset okay so everybody have a nice day uh everybody have a nice evening if you are at the same place like me which you're probably not much not many people but thank you for watching thank you for support and goodbye